This is the black-tailed prairie dog, a rodent species native to grassland habitats in North America. These prairie dogs live in complex societies consisting of tight-knit colonies called coteries. A single coterie is a highly territorial, polygynous family group. They are known for their sophisticated vocal communication. They use alarm calls that contain specific information about the predator type, such as aerial or terrestrial predator. Alarm calls by wild animals often appear to be a counterintuitive behavior, increasing the risk of predation to the signaler while providing beneficial information to other group members. Prairie dogs are known to call more frequently in the presence of their offspring, suggesting that kin selection may be an evolutionary driver of their alarm calls. However, other call properties such as frequency spectra, related to sound pitch, and duration in relation to offspring presence have not been investigated. In this study, the authors investigated these relationships by recording anti-predator alarm calls by prairie dogs at two sites, Pine Ridge Natural Area and Coterie Natural Area in Fort Collins, Colorado in the US. To elicit an anti-predator call response, a researcher approached the prairie dogs to within 20 meters. When an individual began alarm calling, a 30 second sample of the alarm call was recorded. The distance between any recently born pups and the focal adult were also noted. Analyzing over 2,500 call notes, the authors found that peak frequency at both study sites was significantly reduced when pups were within 30 meters of an adult, a distance that represents the average burrow length. It is possible that prairie dogs produce lower frequency alarm calls to avoid attracting predators to juveniles, given that the directionality of low frequency sounds are more difficult to detect. However, this remains unclear because no naturally occurring predatory acts were observed in the study, and alarm calls were elicited by a human. Another finding was that the prairie dogs at Coterie Natural Area had a significantly longer call note duration than those at Pine Ridge. One possible explanation for this is that the Coterie population has a larger colony size and is located in a more urban site with louder anthropogenic noise. Additionally, dialects between these isolated populations may exist. In summary, prairie dogs demonstrate vocal plasticity when they face predatory threats in the presence of kin. If these adjusted vocalizations are more likely to keep their offspring safe, this may imply that kin selection is a driver of alarm call evolution in prairie dogs. Additionally, recent environmental changes such as urbanization may be influencing the behavioral plasticity of black-tailed prairie dogs' vocalizations. If you would like to know more about this study, please go to the website of the Journal of Ethology published by the Japanese Ethological Society.